In this video, I'll show you how to make a Roblox t-shirt. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like as well. We really do appreciate it. And make sure you watch this guide right until the end to the full steps and let's jump straight into this. So as you can see, here we are on Roblox. So the first thing you need to do is come to the Roblox website. I've got a full guide on this for a mobile device as well. If you're trying to do it on mobile, go and check out the channel for that. But then all you want to do is come to the top of Roblox and go and tap on create. Now, if you haven't gone and tapped on create before, you're going to go and get this big page saying uh, manage creations. But what you want to do is go and tap on the on the option below this big box. Then all you want to do is make sure my creations is selected and come down on the left hand side and go and tap on t-shirts. There is an option for shirts. I've got a full guide on how to make a shirt on Roblox. T-shirts are actually slightly different. Just to quickly explain what the difference is with a shirt, you sort of have to design the whole shirt, but with a t-shirt, you just uploaded an image and t-shirts are also free as well so as you can see i've got a few down here already and at the top of the t-shirt page as you can see you've got this option for create a t-shirt so firstly you need to go and find your image but you may want to actually go and get an image first. So you, so you probably want to go and find an image on your computer already or find one on Google, which you can then go and save um, and then you can go and create with. So for example, I could go and head to Google and go and search for the Guide Realm logo as that's what I want to go and create a shirt with. Then go to images, just like so. Go and find our logo, which is this one here. Then I'm going to right click on it and go and click Save Image As and then I can go and save this to my computer by tapping on Save, just like so. And as you can see, it's now downloaded and now I can upload it back to Roblox. But in this case, I actually have another image I want to go and upload. So I'm going to click choose file and my file explorer will open and then double click on the image or click on it and then press open and it's going to go and upload. And here it is. And then what you need to do is go name it. So you can name this anything. I'm going to go and name this video example as this is what it is for. Then all you want to do is tap upload just like so. And as you can see, it's now loading and it's going to go and say t-shirt successfully created. And here it is. Now it's important to note that it's not appearing just like the other shirts because we've just uploaded it and Roblox sort of moderates it, I'm pretty sure, and sort of process the image. So it may take sort of 10 to 20 minutes to be there, but it may take longer in some cases as well. But now I want to go and show you some more features we can do with this. So all you want to do is come to the right hand side and go and tap on this settings cog and go and tap on configure just like so and wait for it to load. Then as you can see, we're now on this sort of Roblox create page. You can go and um, change the name if you'd like, and you can also go and change the description. So I could say this is for the guide round channel. And then you can also go and put the t-shirt on sale as well. So I could click this on and then go and set a price, for example, 10 Robux, um, and you only keep 70% due to the 30% tax. And then you press save changes and there we go. And as you can see, the image is still processing as well. And then you just want to go and press back to avatar items. And if you want to go and head back to Roblox and just go and type in roblox.com again. And here we are back on Roblox. But now you probably want to go and wear the shirt. So to do that, all you need to do is go and tap on avatar just like so and wait for it to load. And I can go and see my t-shirt in the recent section, but if you can't go and find it, then go and tap on clothing, then come to the bottom to classic and go and press on classic t-shirts, just like so, and it'll take a moment to load. And as you can see, here it is. And I can then go and tap on it just like so, and I will go and wear it once it's got unloaded. As I said before, you just have to wait a little bit for it to finish. And that's literally it. If you found this guide useful, please go down below and consider leaving a like, peace.